The Proselyte Recants by Kale Young Rice Read for LibriVox.org by Larry Wilson In Japan Where the fair golden idols sit in darkness and in silence, While the temple drums beat solemnly and slow, Where the tall cryptomerias sway in worship round about, And the rain that is falling whispers low, i can hear strange voices of the dead and forgotten on the dimly rising incense i can see the lives i have lived and my lives unbegotten namu amida butsu pity me i was born this karma of a mother of chuzenji where nantaizan looks down into the lake where the white thronged pilgrims climb to altars in the clouds and behold the holy eastern dawn awake it was there i wandered till a priest of the christians with the crucifix he wore compelled my gaze in grief i had grown so upon its grief i pondered namu amida butsu keep my days it was wrong he told me to pray jiso for my children and binzuru for healing of my ills and our gods so many were conceived he said in sin from lord shaka to the least upon the hills in despair i listened for my heart beat hopeless not a temple of my land had helped me live but alas that day when i let my soul be christened namu amida butsu o oh forgive for the christ they gave me and the only law and lotus as the only way to light that will not wane may perchance have power for the people of the west but to me he seemed the servitor of pain for in pain he perished as one born to passion in some other life no doubt his sin was great though they told me no those who followed him and cherished namu amidabutsu such is fate so again to idols of the buddha who is boundless while the temple drum is beating through the rain i have turned from treason into meditation's truth from the strife the western gods regard as gain and if now i'm dying as the voices tell me to the lives that i must live i'll meekly go till my long grief ends in nirvana and my sighing namu amida butsu be it so end of poem this recording is in the public domain